went like dun 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 ba 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 I could not have picked out a better life partner for Haley. Oh, wait a minute. I did pick him out. <laughs> From the fast friendship that I watched the two of you develop into, the way you two stepped together around Billy Bob's, and the way you bantered and hung out with each other and smiled at each other. You were and Haley's walking up the staircase, and I looked at her, and I said, hey. And she turned around, and I said, what is going on with you and Cole? And she went, I don't know. <laughs> oh, I've wanted to tell that like a big group of people. <laughs> I knew it from day one. I just felt it in my bones. This is everything I have to tell you about love, nothing. This is everything I've learned about marriage, nothing. Only that the world out there is complicated and there are beasts in the night and delight and pain. And the only thing that makes it okay sometimes is to reach out a hand in the darkness and find another hand to squeeze and not to be alone. James Cole Sanford. <laughs> You have been my home for eight years. It's hard for me to explain what I love about you because the answer is so simple. You are what I believe love to be. Tender and patient, persevering and steady, lacking in ego and always curious for the truth. The simple fact I've learned over and over is that you are good all the way through. Haley, you are the love of my life and the most amazing person that I know. You are so incredibly smart, and I get so much joy in learning from you. You are the kindest soul, and I see the world so much more richly because of you. You are so, so beautiful, and how lucky I am that I get to spend the rest of my days having my breath taken away whenever you walk into a room. You're who I want to call when I get bad news, and maybe more importantly, who I want to celebrate with when I get good news. You are who I want to tell all my stories to, and I want to know all of yours. So this is everything I have to tell you about love and marriage. Nothing. Like a book without pages, or a forest without trees. Because there are things you cannot know before you experience them. Because no study can prepare you for the joys or the trials. Because nobody else's love, nobody else's marriage, is like yours and it's a road you can only learn by walking it, a dance that cannot be taught, a song that did not exist before you began together to sing. And because in the darkness you will reach out a hand, not knowing for certain if someone else is even there, and your hands will meet, and then neither of you will ever need to be alone again. And that's all I know. I promise first and foremost to be your biggest supporter. I promise to follow you, to empower you, whether that be to go to New York for you to run a company, or it is to go to a small town in Montana just so you can write poetry. I will be the witness of your life as you are the witness of mine. I will love you as you are today, and I will meet with open arms each version of you I have the privilege to know throughout the years. I will be in your corner even when moments come that I'm not on your side. I will believe in you, and that is easy to do. I promise to love you for the rest of my days. I promise to love you when I'm angry. I promise to love you when I'm happy. I promise to love you during our best hours and our worst. I promise to love you in the joy and the loss and the quiet times in between. Haley Ann Henley, I promise that I will love you with every fiber in my heart, my body, my soul. 
I will laugh with you and cry with you. I will walk beside you in whatever paths life has in store with us. I will love you every day of my life. Folks, it is now with deep joy that by the power vested in me by the state of Texas and ministering in God's name that I pronounce you two husband and wife. Cole, you may kiss your bride. Let's raise our glasses and give a toast to some of my favorite people of all time, to Haley and Cole.